welcome back to Old Chabert Center Park. Yes, I did a vlog here a long time ago. You could check it out on my Suburban Cook County playlist, but yeah, just got done with the Spring Valley Nature Center, and we were literally just a minute or so down the road from one of my old favorite parks, which is kind of the theme of today. I'm going to revisit a couple of my favorite parks for what I used to live in Hoffman Estates, Illinois. I've done plenty of the McHenry things. You know for sure what my local park is there. <laughs> Veterans Memorial Park, formerly Pearl Street Park. Even though I didn't do a ton of videos in Lake Zurich, ironically, when I lived there, I did do some videos at my then local park, Maynard Park. I did a video very early on on my channel covering the fall colors in Lake Zurich and covered the park there. And then as recently as of last year, did a little reunion and visited there with my girls. But for about four years, before Lake Zurich, I lived in Hoffman Estates, Illinois. Before the days of Memories by Wayne, before the days of my YouTube channel, this was my local neighborhood. That being said, we are not currently in Hoffman Estates. We are in Schaumburg. This is Schaumburg Road. See, the weird thing is, I lived in one of the older neighborhoods in Hoffman Estates. It is basically completely surrounded by Schaumburg. Yeah, it's really weird. Take a look at Schaumburg and Hoffman Estates on Google Maps, and they intermingle with each other in the weirdest way I've ever seen. I think I lived in what they called Parcel B. So like the second oldest neighborhood in Hoffman Estates. I was basically on the corner of Higgins Road, Illinois State Route 72, and Roselle Road. But this Schomburg Park was definitely within walking distance. Well, what I quite often did is take my bike over here. Yeah, the blue rodent, which <laughs> still have not taken out nearly as much as I should have over the past couple of years. I would basically take my bike down this side road here, right into my Hoffman Estates neighborhood. Even though I featured this part on the channel before, I actually want to show you my true local park when I live in Hoffman Estates. My equivalent to Veterans Park, my equivalent to Lake Zurich's Mayor Park, we are going to head over to Evergreen Park, which is just a couple blocks down from my house. A park that I have not yet featured on this channel. Now, to be honest, it's not super exciting. <laughs> it's a pond. 
with a trail that goes around it. It's actually really nice. I have taken photos over the past several years or so and put them on the Instagram account, <laughs> but I've never done a video there, which is what we're going to do right now. did not live in that house. And of course I'm not going to show you my house. You know, I'm not going to give away that information even though I don't live there. But welcome to Hoffman Estates guys. We're here. That's a Hoffman State street sign. States Evergreen Park. Just a path that goes around this lake. Or pond, whatever you want to call it. We actually moved before my youngest was even born. <laughs> so she has no memories here. And my oldest was pretty young when we lived down here. She remembered this trail and the pond and the ducks for a while, but doubt if I asked her now she would remember it. Of course, I have a lot of pictures on my Facebook that I took of me and her by this pond. There was a bit of time back in the day when I was working from home still. And I'd walk this path with her during my lunch break. Yeah, I was the work from home, stay at home dad <laughs> for a short time. Although technically we were renting, this was actually the first house I had as a married couple obviously after moving out of North Lake we had apartments previously before we moved up here and so this was our first house <laughs> so it was really exciting you know it was our first chance to really kind of make the place our own within limits of our <laughs> renting agreement but yeah, it was pretty exciting. It was our first place, basically. There is a tennis court here. Yeah, but this kind of felt like our first neighborhood. And I won't lie, it was very very difficult for me to leave this neighborhood. It's just such a quiet, older, more mature neighborhood. 
mixed in with all the amenities that Schomburg has to offer. It was just the perfect combination of everything. A little windy, but some nice colors along the pond here. But yeah, eventually it just became time to head north into Lake County. Where we would spend the next seven years in Lake Zurich before ultimately ending up in McHenry. And at least now I can officially say I've showcased my old neighborhood. Uh, memories by Wayne. Pretty quick and simple video, but I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.